guys today i'll be showing you how to set up your mindsys browser and install metamax okay using this method you can also install any wallet extension of your choice on the mindsys browser so the first thing you do is to download and install the mindsys browser using the link in the description open it follow all the prompts and you see a new tab like this next thing you do is to click on the extension icon next to the search bar at the top of your browser here click on it and click on extensions then you click on open mice's extension store there are two ways to install wallet extensions on your mice browser it's either by using the default mice store which is this or by using the google web store google chrome web store which is at the top right here i prefer the google chrome web store because the mice store doesn't allow you to search you only have to you can only scroll until you find the wallet extension that you're looking for but it categorizes the extension so by clicking on the plus icon you can see different categories but today we are focusing on the wallet extension since metamark is a wallet extension so let's move over to the Chrome web store by clicking on the web store at the top right of the browser and as you can see this is the usual google chrome web store that you're familiar with if you use google chrome so the next thing you want to do is to click on search the store inside the search bar and type the name of the extension that you're looking for in this case is going to be metamask so click click on search click on search and click on metamask okay so we click on metamask here this is the extension and if you're not really happy with the layout you can select you can untick the desktop site depending on how it looks in your screen so we click on add to chrome and you wait accept the prompt and wait for it to install okay our metamax is installed so we'll click on i agree so accept the terms of use you can either create a new wallet if you don't have a wallet already or import an existing wallet so first we'll create a new wallet and then we'll go back to reset it and import an existing wallet so both those that are creating a new wallet for the first time and importing an existing wallet can understand how to use the metamax so first let's create a new wallet by clicking on create a new wallet click on i agree you set your password okay i've set up my password i click on i understand and i click on create a new wallet so now a new wallet has been created if you've created a new wallet you want to secure your wallet okay so click on secure your wallet so you can get your your recovery freeze okay make sure no one is looking over your shoulder write it down on a piece of paper and store it in a safe place so you click on reveal secret phrase so this is my my 12 word phrase i have to write it down on a piece of paper okay once you've written down your 12 word seat phrase you click on next and then the wallet is going to ask you to verify it by just filling where the third and the fourth and the eighth. The numbers might be randomized, so the third word on my phrase is mosquito. So I type it in. The fourth word on my phrase is type. So I type it in. The eighth word on my phrase is attitude. So I type it in. Okay, and remove all the extra spaces in case there are any extra spaces all right so i confirm my wallet and click on got it click on next click on done and voila my metamax wallet is set up you can confirm that your metamax wallet is set up by clicking on the extension icon again and you can see metamax is now showing as one of the extensions you have on your browser okay if you already have an existing wallet and you want to import your, your wallet you click on import an existing wallet click on i agree and it's just a matter of pasting your 12 word seed phrase here okay so i'm going to type out the wallet phrase the one that i just created now so dry um let me pause this video so it doesn't take long okay so i've typed up all the 12 words in my phrase if you want to confirm that you've actually typed out the correct thing you click on the eye icon next 
next to the number here so just to confirm that everything is all right i click on confirm secret recovery phrase and the next thing you do the access for your password so you have to remember your password that you use for your metamax or you create a new one okay if, if you just want to create a new password okay after putting your password you can set a new password if you want or you can use the current one you've been using for your metamax extension so click on import my wallet wait for a few seconds and click on got it so i've shown you how to set up your message browser how to install your metamask how to create a new wallet how to import an existing wallet on metamask so the process is basically the same for any other browser wallet extension that you want to set up on your message browser okay and you'll find the links to all the other wallet extensions that it would be nice for you to have in the description of this video so go ahead to install every one of them because each of these wallets supports slightly different chains so depending on the adult tags you want to interact with you might need to use a particular wallet and all that so i hope this video helps check out my other videos like follow share thank you very much see you next time